back with Andrew Spark this morning from Q Mines. Andrew, morning. Happy New Year, Andy. Good to see you again. Happy New Year also. And a, a strong start to the new year. Uh, drilling at Devlin Creek, that's now complete. 43 holes. You've seen some exceptional results. Tell us more. Yeah, this is the gift that keeps on giving a little bit after Christmas, of course. But uh, no, look, it's a great start for the year for us. Um, you know, obviously, this shows that our, our team worked really hard through the break uh, into the start of the wet season up there. Um, you know, battled through the flies and the, the mosquitoes and all the, the, the heat. But the great thing is they pushed out about 5,000 metres in record time. And, and the results of these, um, you know, the first couple of results have come through now and they're, they're absolutely, absolutely exceptional. So we're really happy with with how it's going, and and this is all about our broader strategy to try and grow the the copper and gold business uh, at Mount Chalmers. Um, so this Devlin Creek asset, which we bought, um, you know, off a company called Zenith Minerals in September last year, um, you know, effectively was all about you know trying to add some higher grade material into that mine plan, and uh, and so look, you know, what was it, twenty meters of almost three percent copper. 0.42 gold, 20 grams silver, and 1.4, you know, zinc. It's it was it was a great start. So very very exciting time for our shareholders. And tell us more about this unexpected development at the window prospect. Yeah, look, it's it's a ripper. So to to sort of give you a bit more context, we've got three deposits at, at Devlin Creek. Uh, so we've got Scorpion, which we started at Window, and also Sulphide City. Uh, and so we started at Scorpion because it's the shallowest of the deposits, but we've now moved the rig down a window. And my God, <laughs> we, we've hit some, we've definitely hit some pay dirt down there. So, um, so it, again, it's shallow, but what's exciting here is it's really broad and we're seeing some, um, some different mineralogy. Um, so as we said in the announcement, we're just going to do some uh, petrology on this uh, because we don't think it's a, one of these high grade VMS deposits. Uh, we think it's got potential to be um, a, a different style of system, which we think bodes well for a lot more scale. Okay, so it's a it's a to be continued story. We've got to do a bit more work on it, uh, but it's really exciting because it really could goose the, the volume here. So, um, so yes, yeah, so the windows windows looking like a, a really good prospect for, um, for this year. And so, looking more broadly at this year, uh, what's the what's the plan? What are you working towards? Okay, so we're, we're planning initially to incorporate these three deposits at Devlin Creek into the mine plan at, at Mount Chalmers. So as a quick refresher, we pushed out a feasibility study just on our Mount Chalmers mine, um, must have been in April, end of April last year, and that showed a very profitable, very low cost, um, long life operation at Mount Chalmers. But we're now, um, you know, given the markets have been a bit soft last year, we're, we're trying to really focus on how we can grow this and try and, um, you know, generate some more return for our shareholders. And so, so initially we'll focus on incorporating those three deposits into the mine plan. So we're going to see more great results. We're going to see, you know, more resource upgrades, um, you know, an updated pre-feasibility study later in the year showing a bigger operation and all the stuff in between. So, yeah, so it's a, going to be a really particularly busy quarter this quarter for us with a lot of news, um, particularly on the drill results, and then followed by resource resource upgrades later in the quarter. So it should be, should be quite an exciting time. And you're in a great spot there too with, with good infrastructure, mind you. We are, yeah. We're, for, um, for your listeners, we're just about 20 k's out of the town of Rockhampton uh, in Queensland. Um, we're right on the coast. We're only 20 k's out off the coast as well. Um, so it's, it's really nice. We don't have to, you know, we're not 500 k's from the nearest pub and, you know, right in the outback, so which you typically see in the mining business. Um, so, yeah, it's a really nice place to operate. As you said, there's a lot of infrastructure. We've got road, rail, you know, airports, everything we need. Um, grid power, bitumen road at the front gate. We're, we're very lucky. So um, so that's, that's what's really giving us a really low capital advantage as we take this down that development path. Great to see you, Andrew. Thanks very much. Thanks, Andy.